Greetings. This is an earthquake watch for the Australian region from July 29 through July 31st, 2015. Significant planetary geometry of past earthquakes in the Australian region indicate a potential for a 5.8 magnitude earthquake for the Northern Territory or surrounding South Australian regions during this watch. We're now looking at the July ephemeris. We have two important planetary connections taking place which will be significant during this watch. Venus and Mars will make a connection with the Sun from July 21st into July 22nd and during this watch period July 29 and to July 30 we have Mercury making a connection with Jupiter and Sun and this does have significance with past earthquakes in the Australian region. As mentioned this Australian earthquake forecast has its focus and attention on Northern Territory specifically the southern portions of Northern Territory stretching in towards the border of South Australia. There are three zones of interest that could be the recipient of this strong earthquake here in Australia. Just east of Lake Mackay which sits on the West Australia Northern Territory border will be the number one area of focus. Just south of Ayers Rock will be the second area of concern and significant threat as it has been activated over the last 10 years. This sits on the Northern Territory South Australia border. And the final area of concern although less likely would be around the Simpson Desert. This does have a history with earthquakes in the past and it should also be noted and mentioned as well. We're now going to look at some interesting planetary geometry and earthquakes that were registered in Northern Territory in 1972, 28th of August and also in 2004, February 11. The interesting planetary geometry involves Venus, Jupiter and also the Earth. Now the Earth position with respect to Jupiter and Venus has a similar symmetry or geometry. Now this is important and definitely worth noting. A magnitude 5.8 earthquake again in Northern Territory in 1989 on May 28th also had the strong symmetry between Jupiter, Venus and the Earth. Now this time Venus was in between both Jupiter and the Earth whereas the previous two occurrences the Earth was in between both Jupiter and Venus. Now this has symmetry into the time period of July 29 and July 31st 2015 as we have the alignment between Jupiter, Venus and the Earth taking place. And another earthquake in the Northern Territory this time a 5.6 magnitude that was registered on August 28, 1972. Now this earthquake had the near alignment of Neptune, Sun and Mercury and this just so happens to be almost identically to what's taking place during this watch period from July 29 through July 31st and this warrants this earthquake watch and forecast for this time period. And now for the earthquake forecast. As mentioned there are three areas of focus during this watch that could receive this potential 5.8 magnitude earthquake with the main area of concern being just east of the Lake Mackay region Areas just east of the Uluru or Ayers Rock would be Curtin Springs and perhaps further east towards the border of South Australia. And the less likely area but also possible would be around the Simpson Desert on the border of South Australia, Queensland and also Northern Territory for this potential 5.8 magnitude earthquake. And finally the important lunar influences that will be in play during this watch period from July 29 through the end of the month we have the Moon conjoining Pluto and the following day the Moon will oppose Mars. But the significant lunar influence will definitely come from the maximum lunar declination which takes place on July 28 and this should be fairly important as the overhead or longitudinal position of the Moon will be fairly strong over the Australian plate during this time frame. If you are interested in this type of information please visit solarwatcher.net where there will be more content for members and subscribers. The July and August newsletters are now currently available and it does feature the Australian and New Zealand regions with their forecasts for the entire month. Annotations and results of this watch will be added at the end of this video. Thanks for watching.